The son of a dream, the American nightmare. Michael, a man who redefined himself away from WWE and is now a main event star. The following is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Atlanta, Georgia, weighing in at 220 pounds, the American Nightmare, Cody Rhodes. From undesirable to undeniable, the prodigal son is back in WWE. And he is set to make up for lost time in a major way. He needs to be ready. If he's not, he'll be next. have already begun. The calm before the Goldberg storm. And what a storm it promises to be. Moments away from an explosion of offense from Goldberg. An insatiable rage and an endless appetite for destruction. A man who thrives in hostile environments and can take you out with one move. And Cody Rhodes will kick things off. Really one of the more remarkable careers in the history of our business, wouldn't you say? He likes to say he went from undesirable to un-GD deniable. I'll keep it PG and simply say he has done it all and found a way to make everything work. And a major step in that work will be the challenge ahead of him. And Goldberg is heated coming into this match. His opponent said Goldberg should have stayed retired. He should have stayed at home with his collection of classic muscle cars. Well, Goldberg will have plenty of time for that, but right now he's looking to uphold a legacy of being invincible. Oh! Cody retaliates. Planted with the Bulldog. All the momentum has swung to Cody Rhodes. Rhodes is unloading offense here. Hoist it up. Suplex! Wards off that offense from Cody. Going right after the neck. Neck breaker. Oh! We know Goldberg is fearless and possesses immense power. Corey, can those things be matched by an opponent? No, and you don't want to go that route. Goldberg likes to work quickly and end it early. You have to drag the match out. Bring everything to a screeching halt. Be strategic. And a Oof. stomp to the gut, too. Cody Rhodes with a Cody Cutter. Is it enough? The cover! Two! What do you have to do to 
to put this guy away. You can see the life left in Goldberg. Might be about to go out. Rhodes about to head to the pay window with Crossroads. Cody Rhodes just might have finished things. Two. And he's still in the game. Not sure if Goldberg even knows where he is right now, but he absolutely just saved himself for the time being. Disbelief on the face of the American nightmare. What's he going to have to do to put this over? Look out. Perfect time to attack when his guard is down. That's playing fast and loose with your own body. That is weaponizing your body. That's what that was. Goes under the ropes to get back inside. Counters! Goldberg able to stop the blitz that was coming his way. Could be a chance for Goldberg to change the complexion of this match. It is launched. Goldberg having trouble gauging this offense. You have to hand it to him. He's taking it to Goldberg right now. This is not a typical Goldberg steamroll. They're slamming their face down. Good defense. Close line. Rose gets out of dodge. Spear from Goldberg. And Goldberg's competition is wishing he had kept his mouth shut. Oh, yeah. That may end the American nightmare. No, my, that was close. The resilience on display from Cody Rhodes is a common occurrence that never gets old. Goldberg has to be frustrated after that, but he won't waste much time beating himself up over it. Striking at will. He knew that was coming. Boom, running STO plants him. Nicely done. Goldberg is completely off the leash. Yeah, some flaws in Cody's game plan are being exposed. Picking up speed, building momentum. Trying to change the tides of the match. No try, and the superstar has changed the tides of the match. Cody Rhodes gonna fly. Cody Carter! And that shows how Cody has really grown from his early years. Rhodes showing he's one of the smartest wrestlers in the game. These superstars have endured so much punishment. Certainly looking worse for wear, but Rhodes looking to end this. For the crossroads! Cody's put a lot of competitors out with that. Cody looking to wrap this one up. Back elbow completely cuts them off. Oh, look at the power now of Goldberg. Just hoisted him up. Jackhammer. Absolute devastation from Goldberg. Cover. Oh, shoulder up before three. The American Nightmare able to persevere here. Absolutely incredible. I don't think I've ever seen Goldberg in more shock than right now. He's in absolute disbelief over that kick out. Boom, bionic elbow. Look at this crowd. It's insanity in here! Bad luck! Rolling into a monkey flip. Here we go! A slingshot cross body! Just a devil-may-care attitude on full display. Going for broke, and it pays off. And he throws the opposition back into the ring. Ducking out of trouble. Stirring back to his feet, but he might not know where he is. Kneecap goes right into the face to halt the attack. Springboard drop kick. He skirts away. Uh oh. Slingshot cross body to the outside. Whip back into the ring. What a cross body. Cody Rhodes going to fly through the air. Cody Cutter. Trying to find his bearings, but it looks like his end is near. Rhodes about to head to the pay window. Crossroads by Cody. Goldberg's down and looks beaten. Two count. Oh, kick out, kick out at two. It's astonishing. The perseverance that Goldberg possesses is on another level. You gotta wonder what more Cody has to do to put him away here. 
keeps him pay with a counter. The WWE Universe has come alive in this one. They are up and they are vocal. A lot of energy in the room. And shockingly, Goldberg is being dominated. Continued offense courtesy of Cody Rhodes. Looking to take flight here. Perched up top. Oh, misses the mark. Oh, God. Rolling into a monkey flip. Look at this! Suicide dive! That is tossing your own body around without a care. Taking no account for their own well-being. the attack. Whatever's playing here can't be good. Oh, God! And the fight keeps being brought to Cody Rhodes. Incredible to think that Goldberg's sheer power still remains a huge factor in this match. And he slides him back to the mat. Big forearm. Oh! Uh-oh! Oh, oh that'll keep Goldberg at bay. With the Larian. Whoa! Cross body! Whoa! That was coming in hot at breakneck speed. Going fast and living dangerously. Thrown back in under the ropes. He's positioning himself. Closing in. Cody Rhodes with a... Goldberg able to dodge that. Goldberg finds his target with that one. Ouch. He knows how to avoid contact. How's that for a counter? The American Nightmare. Crossroads. Cody Rhodes nailed it. Looks like he has his finger on the trigger now. Cody Rhodes hooks him up. There's Crossroads. What an exclamation mark right there. That's got to be it. Two. There it is. Cody Rhodes gets it. Let's take another look at these guys in action. Here is your winner. The American Nightmare, Cody Rhodes. Got to hand it to our winner. Standing tall with their arm raised tonight. Oh my God. Goldberg loses. It happened when he became 173 and 1. Remember, guys, the title is on the line here in this one. And I don't remember the last time the champ was in this much jeopardy, Cole. Tonight might just be the night the title changes hands.
The champ comes into his title defense incredibly competent, Corey. And with good reason, Cole. When you're the champ, you don't have to worry about winning. You just have to make sure you don't lose. That is the champion's advantage. The following contest is a tag team steel cage match and is for the Raw Tag Team Championship. Introducing the challengers at a combined weight of 439 pounds, Finn Balor and Damian Priest, the Judgment Day. And their opponents, at a combined weight of 501 pounds. They are the Raw Tag Team Champions, Solo Sokoa and Jimmy Uso, the Bloodline. The goal is obtaining those Tag Team Championships. Being on the same page will be vital in this one. We should be in for one heck of an encounter here for the Raw Tag Team titles in this, this classic steel cage match. Many of superstars competed for the title in this environment. Joining that list will be Finn Balor and Damian Priest. And in the other corner, they will be dealing with Solo Sokoa and Jimmy Uso. Guys, plenty of championships have been decided inside a steel cage over the years. These superstars are going to go to war tonight. And while no war zone looks like the steel cage, that doesn't mean these competitors haven't come prepared for battle. Fortitude being tested with every step. There's arguably nothing worse than that feeling the first time flesh meets steel. The pain and shock that go coursing through your body when it happens, not exactly the type of thing any superstar wants to go through. But in this match, you have to learn how to bear, learn how to withstand the onslaught of pain. Endurance is truly key. Oh, man, inverted backbreaker. Ow! Oh, man, right to the arm. Hyperextender elbow. Jimmy Uso with a well-timed shot. STO! Oh, what? Meet face. All right, it's a line. It's cinched in. This could be over. This won't win the match, but we're going to free the arm and does just that. position to be caught in here. Snake eyes. Oh, this isn't pretty. The challenger eating up some damage. Neckbreaker. And a oh, fiery lariat. Come on the shoulders. Oh, close line. Here he goes, moving up the cage wall. Better be quick about it. Not much time to get over. <laughs> Trying to make their way out of the cage. Oh, my back. Needs to be careful, though. Every movement is a dangerous one. Oh, wicked kick to the lower back. Ooh. Up and... Oh, no. He comes off the cage and lands right back in the ring. Yeah, he's going to have to try something else now. Down with the Samoan drop. Rapid fire Samoan drop. Uh oh. Countered it just in time. Oh, God. Brutal chop block. Look, the most intelligent competitor in a battle knows that there are many roads to victory, including the low road. He foiled that attempt. Enough already. Busted out an impactful maneuver. Moved at the right time. 
Got to wonder if the stamina is there to make it all the way. And that was offense with a hurtful purpose. He's all the way to the top of the cage. Not many options for him. Ooh. And he's able to reverse. He's working toward making his escape. He can almost taste the win in this cage match. Fought so hard to be in this position, but he's only halfway to victory. Lands face first. Yeah, that one busted Jimmy Uso up real good. Heading up and maybe heading out. Face first into the cage. Crashing to the mat. Oh, down he goes. So close, yet so very, very far away. Elbow drop right on point. Making the climb up the cage. Here he goes. Jumping double stomp. And every inch climb puts you in a more perilous position. Pulls the leg. Left jack. Way up there. Is this the right time? Is this the right moment? He's determined to make it to the top of the cage here, guys. In search of some footing to make this huge climb. Trying to make their way out of the cage. The challenger is in some big trouble. Yeah, not looking good at all. Letting him kick. Looking for a grip to get themselves over the cage. And that was a precisely measured attack. And Priest with the wherewithal to counter. He's nearly there. Just a few more sure-footed steps, and he's victorious. This is the moment for him. This is how winners are made. Oh, yeah. All they got to do now is hit the floor with both feet. What a splash! Oh, no. Oh, man. Capitalizing on Sokoa's mistake. It's going to take a lot of willpower to make it all the way to the top. Getting set up for something in the corner. Running hip attack. What impact. Supreme confidence here from Jimmy Uso. But he is giving his opponent a lot of time here. Getting ever so close to the very peak of the steel cage. And would you look at that? He could be well on his way to escaping the steel cage. Heck of a view from up there, but he'll enjoy a view from the floor even more. And as he continues to climb the side of the cage, you have to think his confidence is starting to build. All he has to do is drop down to the floor, and his hand will be raised. He's going to do it. He's climbing down from the top of the cage. Slowly savoring the victory moment. Win within his grasp. Feet at the floor. He wins the match. And he's thrown from the cage down to the mat. Oh, I did not like the... Winding up. Boom! Samoan spike. I think the champ's got it. We might have a successful escape on our hands. Jimmy Uso is feet and the champs retain. These superstars put on quite a show. Here's another look. about as conclusive a win as you can get in the cage. Tag team excellence in its purest form. You simply love to see it. And I hope we see these guys tagging again real soon. The following contest is an Extreme Rules match and is for the Women's World Championship. Yeah. 
The man has arrived. And the WWE Universe is on their feet. She is as tough as they come. Yeah, these days the outfits may be a little fancier, but the passion in Lynch remains the same. Perhaps the most popular competitor in women's division history. One of the most popular competitors in the women's division. Guys, Liv Morgan just living out her dream here in WWE. Yeah, Liv's career has just really taken off. Became this money in the bank and then successfully cashed in the contract to become SmackDown Women's Champion. Introducing the challenger from Dublin, Ireland, Becky Lynch! And her opponent from Elmwood Park, New Jersey, she is the Women's World Champion, Liv Looking at the champion, I guarantee there is no doubt in their mind as to who is leaving this match with the title around their waist. This is arguably the biggest challenge the champ has faced yet. You can feel it. Absolutely. We can easily see the title change hands here tonight. Or we can see a champion do whatever it takes to prevent such a thing from happening, gentlemen. And here we go. Oh, look into the arm bar. And here we go. Gotta find a way. Quick out of the cross arm breaker. Shifting the weight. Fighting out. Catches the leg. Shot right to the gut. Oh, right to the kidneys. Golly. Oh, perfect kick. And it's reverse pain for that mistake. A oh, nice hip toss. And an elbow drop to the arm. Oh, that backfired on her. Bad landing. There's a lot of hard ways to land, but that might be the hardest. I know it may not sound extreme, but honestly, the best course of action in this match is to be cautious. Don't get into the car crash mindset just because the match allows it. Do what you have to do to succeed, but don't do something you'll regret just because it's extreme rules. Be smart. Uh-oh, she has trouble coming. Not going to be easy to get out of this. Oh, nowhere to go. No she won't fade. She just won't fade. She keeps fighting. Oh, step up in Zagari. Challenger's a little worse for wear now. She wants to take this one outside the ring, it seems. And
And now thrown back into the ring. Ooh, what a four. Oh, a strong impact. Able to get out of the way. Fisherman suplex. Lynch has got it. I can't believe she's hanging on this long. She's got a tap. Oh, this trap, but she gets away. Drop kick. <laughs> it's the mark. Liv Morgan picking up speed. Face breaker 201 style. And into the count. There's two. Not yet. Accepted. She's taking this outside. This one cannot be lost by count out. Heads out of the ring. What's next? Taking things to another level. Bringing out the ladder like this. She's going under the ring now. And here comes Old Faithful. The steel chip. Hold on a second. Could be a matter of time. Submission being locked in. Oh, we've seen this before, fellas. She's a she won't fade. She just won't fade. She keeps fighting. Run face like a play into the guillotine. Can Becky Lynch hold on? Can Becky Lynch survive? Fighting desperately. Able to shrug off her opponent. Reversal from Morgan. Liv is really out of it. She might be done soon. Oh, round and round we go. Shilt the world head scissors. Chuck to the outside. And I got a strong feeling there's more to come. And it's taking high risk. Will it pay off? Suicide down. That's finding any which way to topple the competition. Hurling your own body like that is insane. No telling what's underneath the ring tonight. And all of a sudden, the complexion of this match has changed with the introduction of a sledgehammer. And she slides her back to the mat. Boom. Drop kick! Oh, just whipped into the table. Momentum is running away from Becky fast. Liv is holding nothing back. She'll take things into the ring. Quick thinking pays off. She's trying to fight back in this one. <laughs> Becky. Manhandle slam. The champ's eyes look Quite glazed ahead. over. We almost had a new champion. We knew it was not going to be an easy task to put the champion away, and that's... This might be the beginning of the end. Oh, man, here's a slam. The title's in jeopardy here. I think the paradigm is shifting. It wasn't enough. She kicked out. I can't believe it. We were a second away from a new champion. Are we close to the start of a new reign? And maybe now, Lynchester about soaring. Big miss right there. And she's stunned in the corner. She has no idea where she is right now. Uh-oh, this isn't gonna end well for someone. Going up top. Oh my god. Jump the champion into the cover. And she fights it off. She just will not go away. Liv has her marked. Cut off with a kick to the gut. Snap suplex. Challengers 
Becky Lynch looking for it. Oh, manhandle slam. We could have a new champion. Two. And that's it. New champ. New champ. That had to be one of the matches of the year. Let's take another look at some of the action. Here is your winner, and new women's world champion, Becky Lynch. Truly a huge win for this superstar, or should I say, for the new champion. Honestly, Michael, there is no way I can think to describe this other than absolute goosebumps. Then imagine how the new champ must feel, Byron. The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the World Heavyweight Championship! Here comes Seth freaking Rollins, the visionary and the revolutionary of WWE. A decade of being WWE's freaking workhorse and the WWE Universe is finally singing his praises. I don't think anybody in WWE runs their mouth quite as much as Seth freaking Rollins. Yeah, but nobody delivers on their promises like he does either. I don't know about you guys, but I got goosebumps. The people's champion is here. Saxton, you couldn't warm the bench for Team Bring It. You can just feel the energy of the Great One as he saunters down to the ring. Oh, he's the most electrifying man in sports entertainment, and he's taken WWE by storm. <clears throat> if you smell Whoa, 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 whoa. This ain't sing along with the rock, Saxton. I thought it was. Now, we know Seth Rollins is a master of mind games, so if you're this superstar, whatever it takes, whatever you have to do, keep Rollins out of your head.
Introducing the challenger from Davenport, Iowa, weighing in at 217 pounds, Seth Freakin' Rollins! And his opponent from Miami, Florida, weighing in at 265 pounds, he is the World Heavyweight Champion, The Rock! The energy in this arena is palpable. These competitors know exactly what's on the line. Here you have the championship on the line, a champion on high alert. Ladies and gentlemen, we're in store for something special. Bullseye with the drop kick. The Rock reminding us all once again that we are watching the most electrifying man in sports entertainment at work. Bullseye! Oh, an inverted atomic drop. Very nice. Ooh, again. Oh, wicked kick to the lower back. Oh, a nasty stomp to finish it off. The challenger eating up some damage. The Rock has seen and done it all in WWE, but all of his accolades have come with their share of injuries. Don't count on that to be a factor, Cole. The Rock is in the best shape of his career, and even when things go wrong, the Great One can still gut it out and get the W. Right up, Belly! Uh-oh! Versatility from Rollins. Seth rolls through. Oh, what a super kick from the Architect. Fighting back with a counter. Drop kick. Drop kick. Oh, oh, great height. Here's the pin title on the line. And the referee stops the count before two. I can't believe the ref didn't get two here. And the rock gets warded off. Reversal on top of reversal. Spine buster. The millions are about to experience it. Full head of steam. Able to give him the slip. Look at this. It's now suplex. Don't do it. And he's able to counter. Brought back into the ring from the floor now. Drops the hammer. Right on the lower back. And a Oof. stomp to the gut, too. Look at this. Just stomp after stomp after stomp. And Rollins capitalizes. And able to counter. The Rock left an opening for the counter. Single leg drop kick caught him. He turns it around. Rollins dodges in the nick of time. Sling blade! Picture perfect drop kick. Ooh. The champ trying to roll with these hits. Able to avoid there. Quickly into the cover with the title on the line! New champion! New champion! Still only got one. If that won't beat him, I'm not sure anything will.
Getting him into the corner. Rollins now from the middle rope. What a stop. That was brutal. And, and now the blood is flowing from the Rock's face. Based on what we just saw, I think this match is far from over. Uh-oh. It's good. We're going to see it. Stop. Going to see a new champ. What a display of stamina. The champ showing they're truly worthy of this title. But things might only get harder from here. How often do you see Seth Rollins come up that short, that close? If this lands, it's over. Phoenix Splash! And The Rock is getting dismantled. Rollins is set to slay. Look at this heel hook. This is how you punish your opponent, and he's enjoying every minute of it. Got the leg, and dropping the elbow right on the knee. And countouts are legal, so hopefully this will be a short trip outside. And it's The Rock with the reversal. And he tosses him back in now. How is this superstar still in this match? Hard right, determination. Looking for a change of fortune here. What a clothesline! Out the Pingles champ! Are you ready for the most electrifying move in all of entertainment? Pingles elbow! But champions need to finish the job for the win! Two! Oh, and he just kicked out simply refusing to let this opportunity slip away. And who knows if there'll be another shot, yet you can't give up now. The Rock reformulating his game plan. It was not enough to end this, so he'll have to move on to plan B. I am feeling a titanic shift roaring through this crowd right now. Well, you're not the only one, Saxon. It's all coming to a head now. Uh-oh. About to hit rock bottom. A championship level move. There it is, The Rock wins and keeps the title around his waist. Sometimes a match can't live up to the hype, guys, but that one sure did. Here is your winner, and still World Heavyweight Champion, The Rock! You cannot say they didn't give it their all and then some to achieve this victory. I strongly suggest Seth Rollins dedicates some more time to doing homework on his opponent. There's a lot of notes he can take from tonight. Hey, Seth Rollins is a true student of the game. He is simply phenomenal. <laughs> you said it, Michael. A phenomenal resume, phenomenal skills, and without a doubt, a phenomenal performer. The following is an eight-man ladder match. Making his way to the ring, representing the OC from Gainesville, Georgia. Weighing in at 218 pounds, 
the phenomenal AJ Styles. AJ Styles is an athlete who many would argue possesses the best all-around skill set in WWE. Styles has an unmatched drive to win. Undeterred passion, fire, and desire. And we're going to see it on display tonight, courtesy of the Phenomenal One. You know, being known as Phenomenal, that's just the beginning. Well, anytime AJ Styles is in the ring, you have to almost assume that it's going to turn into an instant classic. Yeah, another one's imminent tonight. Well, here comes L.A. Knight. A man who brings the excitement level to the max. And from Hagerstown, Maryland, weighing in at 230 pounds, L.A. Knight. Calls himself the megastar. Well, he won't be one of those in the fashion world, but L.A. Knight might be able to earn that moniker in the ring. Well, I don't think anybody's going to argue the point that L.A. Knight is one of the most arrogant competitors in NXT history. I would agree with you, Saxton, but L.A. Knight has earned that arrogance with big wins over top talent. Well, now L.A. Knight is set to dominate all of WWE. Well, here comes the Scottish warrior. Carrying his trusted blade, Angela, McIntyre summons the support of the WWE Universe into battle. The Scottish warrior has earned every bit of respect he is given. He is transformed from the chosen one to a real life fire breathing dragon. Yeah, the WWE is the Scottish warrior's battleground and he will go face to face with absolutely anyone. The one, the only, Logan Paul. And from Cleveland, Ohio, weighing in at 185 pounds, Logan Paul. Well, there are quick learners, and then there's Logan Paul. You can count his matches on one hand, but he's already a main eventer and in the championship picture. question for you guys. How many folks can say they made their WWE debut across the ring from Rey Mysterio at WrestleMania? You're right, Corey. Uh, Logan Paul accomplished something that few ever have. And Rey Mysterio was the one who felt the honor. Oh. Make way for the ring general, Gunther. Six foot 